Hey, it's Mike Hambright from Flipner.com, and we have a quick VIP tip to share with you from Dan Miller, who's going to share a tip on how crowdfunding is going to change the shape of our investing landscape. So we're, we're in the midst of the biggest regulatory shift around fundraising and capital raising since the initial r- rules were written in the 30s and 40s. So right now, most of the rules around fundraising were written in 1933 and 1934. As you can imagine, a lot of big shifts in the market since then. The idea of the internet obviously wasn't apparent then. So the Jobs Act passed in 2012, eased most restrictions around raising capital in terms of accessing individual investors, marketing publicly using the internet. And so we're in the midst of those those changes being uh, being put in place by the SEC, but there's really a fundamental shift happening of allowing people to raise capital directly online from large networks of investors. You know, called crowdfunding, but it, it really is much bigger than that. It's restructuring the centralized financial model where all capital went hand to hand to New York and then back out to places in the country, to digital networks that can connect online for almost no cost, distribute investments, manage the whole process efficiently. So we always say, I mean, we, we came into crowdfunding, funding our own deals by being early, by learning about the process, by signing up for crowdfunding websites, obviously like Fundrise by investing in a few deals, by raising capital for your own projects. I think there's just enormous advantage to the early adopters of online fundraising, of crowdfunding, who are aware of the regulatory shifts. Similar to people that were early with Twitter and blogs, now have dominant network followings. I think you'll see similar process for real estate, for crowdfunding, people that are early on building a brand online, raising capital, returning money to investors. Uh, will over time have a dominant source of funding that will be very hard for late entrants to compete with. So it's really a fundamental shift in, in capital raising being put in place as we speak, and I think people should be very aware of it. Thanks for joining us for another Flipner.com expert tip. To access hundreds of tips and full expert interviews, please visit Flipner.com or join us in the iTunes store. We'd like to thank our sponsors, RealtyMogul.com and National Real Estate Insurance Group. To access the most robust social platform in existence for real estate investors, where you can find off-market wholesale deals, find great vendors to help you in your business, and learn and socialize with other real estate investors, please visit the all-new flipnerd.com. If you're not yet a member, you can set up a free account in less than a minute. Please note, the views and opinions expressed by the individuals in this program do not necessarily reflect those of flipnerd.com or any of its partners, advertisers, or affiliates. Please consult professionals before making any investment or tax decisions as real estate investing can be risky.